crazy. All right, here we go. Fede, we got to win one in a row. Let's see what our second ship in this streak attempt is. Three, two, one, and random. The Stealth B. Here it is, everybody. <laughs> the Stealth B. Here it is, the run, the streak killer. So for those who are not familiar with Hardmo No Pause FTL streaking, this ship I think is widely considered the least consistent ship in the game. Because there are so many things that is susceptible to early. Like any drones, any beams, um, Forced asteroid field, probably less likely, but. All right, well. Goodness gracious. So there's a couple things we want to do here. Um, we want to get our O2 on our ship below, was it 40%? To raise the chance that they try to attack O2 rather than weapons, is that right? Do I need to actually do that? Is it below 40% or 50%? For those who watch Hollow and stuff, what's the what's the what's the venting? Is it this? Or can I keep this closed? I feel like I kinda need there there to be O2 in my O2 room to not just lose it. It's 35? Is it really 35? <clears throat> yeah, doing the laniest achievement on cell D, right? Uh, where's where's uh, Britnoff? Let me see if I can look it up. Uh, FTL stealth B hard no pause low O2 strap. Uh, hey, my own videos are coming up. That's funny. Uh, let's see. Here, in short, depowering your weapons lowers risk of weapon room getting targeted, and auction being below 50% makes it more likely the auction gets hit instead of cloaking. All right. So it's only 50% that I need it to be. So I think I can do this. Do, 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 do. It's been a while since I've had that since I've rolled this ship so let's do that all right here we go my friends stealth b let's hope we don't get a beam master okay he's got hacking but no drone i think you're supposed to not take a lot of fights on the ship too but i feel like i probably should take this and just hope he doesn't hack my weapons Man, do you just never take hacking fights, too? I just don't know all the rules. Where's Britnoth here? The tack, though. Oh, that's the best tack. That is the best tack. Good. Oh, my O2. Hey, they shot my O2! Hey, that's a good sign that this might be working. We want to go this way. That gives us the most damage. Okay, good. Okay. Double reward. Nice. And I think what you're supposed to do is your first 50 scrap goes into the weapon value. Is that right? I think that's correct. Oh, Britnoth, you're here. You take hacking as it's 1 and 8 that it's weapons. Okay. Cloaking 3 is first. It's not the weapon value. Okay. All right. Save up for shields. Well, eh. Oh man, that's like... That's, uh... You usually can't get enough scrap in hard mode before you're dead if you don't do some upgrade. I think that was gonna hit my cloaking or weapons. Oh, it's this the streak might be over right now just because a single beam drone. Okay, piloting means we don't get to dodge. 
Didn't hit my weapons. Didn't hit my weapons. I think we got it. Yes. Okay. Okay. Cloaking three, then to, then to hacking or a weapon, then shields in sector three is the plan. Okay. Oh, God damn it. Freaking hell. Okay, close all of our doors. Smell it. This didn't save my positions here. You're there. You're there. Save that. Open all of these. Maybe 10% of the time you find uh, hacking in Sector 1. I find hacking in stores quite rare on this ship. And I would assume you actually use hacking on weapons or drones a lot of the time rather than anything else on this ship, right? Hacking is for making you not take damage kind of thing. Attack the slaver scum, I think. It is a flak and a heavy laser, I know. But we have cloaking. And we can cloak this first volley. I think we still take it. He's going for O2. Both shots went for O2. That's kind of showing that this, this strategy actually really does look like the best chance for this ship. Wow, that's a really good deal. So, can I can I take a deal like this or do I really just have to get scrap? I don't even know. I don't even know, but I feel like I want to take that. <laughs> Uh, that's worth two power if you have the micro. Let's do it. All right, where do I put them? Maybe just do it this way. Scrap we save on power later. Yeah, but early scrap is the most important scrap, I think. Uh, we use Zoltan to pull power from Cloaking quite often. Ah, so if we, like, cloak, and then it, once it wears off, go like this, and that gives us a power back kind of thing. I have to heal him after doing that, but... In short, yes. Yeah, there's probably more to it, I'm sure. Uh, okay. I guess the other problem is if I pull him out, though, the glade beam charge thing. I don't know if it'll... i got to be really careful with this. Uh, so half power nebula. Half power. What do we have on this ship? We have seven... So we'll have four plus two. One, two, three. So we'll have six in total. Is that right? Maybe it's a piloting blue option. I don't want to spend scrap on piloting. I guess we're going to potentially go for that. All right, he doesn't have cloaking. He does have mind control. Okay, that's good. Didn't hit my weapons. Don't bomb my weapons, don't bomb my weapons. Okay. 
Nice double reward. There's our first 50 scrap. So we can get that level 3 cloaking now. If that's what we want to do. Plasma storms are questionable on this ship. Well, I haven't committed to it yet. There was one other place we could have gone there. The extra power makes this even better, the uh, cloaking even better, right? Because we have enough power to actually have our max dodge with the level 3 cloaking. Hmm. Plasma Storm. So if it is the manually search the nebula one, which is the one in four to lose crew. Is that a worthwhile gamble? Is that a worthwhile gamble? Hey, what's up, JFKs? How much power will I have again? Four. Let's start like that and I'd have one power I can move from O2 into cloaking. If it's a manly search, you might even risk that with four crew, because if you lose crew, you at least get some scrap, yeah. I, I, pro I was thinking that I probably would risk it too. Okay, okay. My ship was not prevented though. I think we'll be able to get our crew around. I think. With four crew, I think we're okay. Yep, we're fine, we're fine. It's fine, it's fine. Okay. Fine, nothing to see here. Easy game. <laughs> easy game, easy life, right? Okay, all right. That was probably worth, honestly. We took, uh, what, two damage to get, did we get like 18 scrap or something there? I swear I've saved these positions five times. I press you 8,000 times. Okay. This, 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 and this. Okay. All right, what's the cloaking button? H to add power there? Okay. Oh, it's a half power fight, though. Do I actually just get power right now? That does, doesn't actually get me any extra power, so probably not. Goodness. I have level one cloaking I'll be able to use. Okay, his heavy laser's not online, which is actually great for us. Phew! That was a weapon shot! He gets two shots off before one, doesn't he? Yeah. Okay, we're good. We're good. Frickin' clutch dodges, man. Wow, okay. Uh, Distress Beacon, we can't do giant alien spiders. So I think we just take the ship fights here. So, hacking, you said, is usually the next thing we're looking for, hacking. I usually try to get 
weapon value or shields next. And we just cloak from the beginning here, I think, is the way you're supposed to do this. I need to hit the weapons as quickly as possible there. You were told the stress isn't terrible on this ship as well? Okay. There's the Zoltan blue option, I think, right? Oh my gosh, they're offering me so many good crew options. I think this one I turned down, right? I think this one we turned down, even though I really, really want to take him. Because we got to get the scrap. Golly, that's such a good... That's such a good thing. It's 20 scrap. 22 scrap even. Nice. Uh, who am I and what have I done with Rand? Uh, I am a guy who's going to try to actually succeed on getting, you know, the hard mode no flash rate going. So, like, I could do this for weapon value, but I, I don't think we do that. Since we have the level 3 cloaking, I mean, beam drones still wreck us. Yeah, I gotta trust your micro to deal with borders. Yeah. Oh god, I wonder if I should have let him board first. Let me actually close these doors, but prevent. Keep it vented. Heavy laser might get a shot off. Okay, he didn't go after weapons. Great. Kill him, kill him, kill him. Yes! <laughs> Correct cloak timing. You always you always cloak at the beginning, right? I feel like I remember, like, Lethal Frag one time saying it's better to wait, but I think it doesn't make any difference, right? You just you cloak at the beginning. I think you're always supposed to cloak at the beginning. Oh, okay. I waited until he reached the teleporter, so that was the correct... Okay, that's what you meant for timing. Okay. <laughs> well, I was thinking about that border coming over. It was a bit accidental, but I was always thinking... I was also thinking I don't want him over here yet, so... Accidental, but semi-planned. If they're waiting in teleporter, they're not manning systems. Ah, I gotcha, I gotcha. Okay, so same thing here. There we go. Gotcha. Well, now I know. I'm glad... Glad I learned. There's another little micro thing I didn't know about. No heavy laser shot. Beautiful. Oh my gosh, they're offering so many good crew. I just I can't do it, right? I can't do it. I can't do it. I need the scrap. God, I've turned down a mantis and a rock, dude. Rock blue options. Now, if it was an NG, I would have considered it. Rock does have some blue options, but I feel like they're not as consistent as NG blue options. And still, we just, we're really close to, I mean, we have shields now, right? Uh, no, there's nothing to sell on the ship. Never mind, I was thinking stealth A with titanium system casing. Which the ship should have, by the way. Oh, goodness. That is a forced sun. Unless I dive. That is a forced solar flare. I kind of think diving is better than a forced solar flare. I think. Get some, like, engine and power upgrades for the dive, maybe? Let's 
Prevented. Well, the problem is, when Bambola, when you have no shield and a solar flare, it does, like, double the amount of fires. So... Hmm. Leads have at least two shields. Yeah, but if I get a couple engine points, we just... We just cloak and run. Level three cloak and run. Three to four fires, you think? I mean, what are the chances it doesn't start a fire in my weapons? Like, or my piloting? So the question is, is a ship fight with guaranteed, like, bunch of fires better than diving? There could be a store over here, too, which if it was was hacking, we could, like, hack the enemy weapons. We haven't seen a store this sector, so there's a decent chance there's a store. I think we do. I think we go for the dive. I think that's the... I think that's safer. Than a solar flare with no shields. Do not buy fuel. Now if it's a bunch of empty jumps, that would suck. Uh, with no shields, it does three damage and five to six fires. Wow, is it that much? Okay. Okay. No drones, thankfully. I don't think the mini beam will get off in time since it's the shots right next to the weapons. Nice. Double reward? Oh man, really? We just got away from shields. So I guess the best thing would be we go here store that has shields and we have shield before the dive would that be better than like getting hacking i don't know you're expecting a map not gonna lie okay you think hacking would be better but not okay I guess hacking makes it so that you don't have to get another weapon to get through shields. Good eye on. Okay, he didn't fire. That's good. Ooh, that heavy laser was about to fire, though. <laughs> There's your map. Thanks, Explosive Ash. Nine scrap and a map. Thanks, game. Well, there's a the store. There it is. Hmm. How about no systems? Do we buy a flak? Or do I skip? How much to get the flak online? It's so expensive, isn't it? 125, yeah. Flak alone isn't that great. I, you know what we could do? We could make a transition from Glaive to Flak Chain. 16 second charge time. That might actually be a play and then do a little bit of like engine upgrades for the dive. Flak is a solution to not finding hacking, which isn't very likely. Huh. Is it enough to one shot? No. But Flak Chain is faster easier to uh easier to uh upgrade with other stuff it's definitely not as efficient though because we're spending a lot of scrap just to change weapons uh, if only we knew what system we were going into so we're going into a dive Should I spend scrap on engines or no? I think I don't get the flak. I think I don't do it. I mean, I could do that upgrade and then... I actually could afford the upgrade to the weapons. I just can't do that and buy the flak. I could get one weapon upgrade and the flak. Don't need power. Really? How am I getting enough power? 
Oh, I guess we uh, we micro between cloaking and the engines. Oh yes, we take the Zoltan, we move the Zoltan, that's out. That's what it is, okay. Okay, so how do we do this? We, um, uh, we cloak at the beginning of the fight. Do we have one more jump before the... No, this is the dive. We cloak at the beginning of the fight. No, we cloak as late as possible so that we're cloaked during the ASB shot. Actually, I'm not 100% sure how to do this. Maybe I just take my power to Glade Beam. I don't know. Let's see what the ship is. It's a Vulcan. That's actually quite good for us, but Mini Beam is kind of bad for us. It's piloting. I wonder if piloting value point would have been better. I'm going to cloak now. Did I time that? Hit my pilot. I hit my engines. That's really bad. be dead. Okay, we got level 3 cloaking up again. Now we don't. Oh god, keep setting fire. Let me get out of here. I need out. Oh, God, only three health. Oh, man, he ASB'd my engines. So unlucky. He ASB'd my engines, and then he ASB'd my cloaking while I was cloaked that second time. You do believe the die was not worth it. Well, you know, hindsight and all that. Solar Flare could have just killed us. You don't know. It could have been a Solar Flare with... Uh, it could have been a, a Beam Drone Solar Flare or something. Not even good choices for uh, sectors either. Oh man. Do I go Zoltan for hoping for a store, I guess? You're holding back on backseating. Well, when I'm asking for help, you can tell me what I could have done differently. You think I should have bought the flak and fourth engines? I don't know, I don't know, man. If I didn't have the power, I don't know how I would have been able to leave the power all that. Greatest comeback? I mean, anything's possible, but not very likely, most likely. Not very likely, most likely. Just not power the glaive and leave the Zeltan in there? Gotcha. I don't think our glaive ever fired anyway, did it? Have I tried power overwhelming in the console command? I have not tried that. I'm gonna fix the breaches. Because I'm not like Necro who likes to leave breaches lying around his ship. Uh, did the glaive beam shoot and cloaking early? Uh, I don't think so. Uh, I don't think Glaybeam ever charged us fast enough to do that. Even with how much I delayed it, I don't think it did that. Alright, do we have a store? No, we have a forced something. <laughs> At least it's not a forced solar flare. Ugh, looking bad, man. Looking bad. This is Sector 2, right? Okay. Oh yeah, and beams don't show your cloak anyway, so no, it didn't. This can be five free hole damage, right? Can this be five free hole damage?
Um, this can be a store, free crew. Can it be five freehold damage? Anybody know? Anybody in chat? I don't think it can. It's free borders, though. Okay. Okay. Crap. I don't have doors. Okay, that's fine. He should actually repair them in time to, to vent them. Oh god, don't hit my weapons, don't hit my weapons. Okay. You got him. You know, one health. <sighs> well, actually, if I don't take the surrender, I think this drone is alive long enough to get one more shot. I think I actually have to take the surrender to not die, if I'm not mistaken. He's about to take the shot. Let's take it. Okay. One health. One more than I need. Wait, no, that's the exact amount of health I need. I'm already dead. <laughs> All right. We're alive. It's fine. It's fine. I'll be honest, I'm not exactly sure the strategy of how you get your power back out of cloaking without your weapon going offline. Let me see what happens when I do it while cloaking. Okay, it doesn't take the power out of O2. Or it doesn't take the power out of the weapon. You're just not supposed to have the Zoltan in weapons? I don't know where I'd put him then, if I want the power. Do I put him there and not have anybody in doors? You do it with the guy in engines? Ah, uh, you do it like this? So if we're like this and then it's about to end and go like that, we get our power back kind of thing. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Use the Zoltan engine. Engine Zoltan, gotcha. Well, there's store. We are one scrap short of shields. But what we're really hoping is for is um, hacking and repair, I guess, right? Oh my god, two stores with no systems. That's gotta be super unlucky, right? There's another store. There's another store. We have a weapon option. What's our weapon option? Ion bomb? Ion bomb, reloader, repair. Although we have to... Re we have to... Oh, uh, 105 scrap. Okay. Well, we have another store. We can take ion bomb. Reloader's a bait, you think? Hmm. Hacking would just be way better, right? Let's check the store. Other store. Three stores with no systems, man. What could you do with Ion Bomb? Uh, you get one extra weapon power and have Ion Bomb plus Glade Beam because Ion Bomb is... Charges three seconds faster than Glade Beam, so you can take shields down with it. <sighs> okay, well, I guess we go back for the Ion Bomb. <laughs> okay, let's go do that, I guess. Take the power of O2 into Cloaking, and I just spend the rest on sh repairs, I think. That's kind of our only option here. Okay. Oh, I didn't have my people over there. Okay. All right, his weapons are pretty weak, so we'll get our, I think, one shot off here. 
Ion Bomb can one-shot a Zoltan Shield, too. Or do we Glaive Beam because that'll one-shot his Zoltan Shield with ending up in weapons and then Ion Bomb his weapons afterwards? That'll do two damage to his weapons with Glaive Beam alone. So I think we actually don't fire the Ion Bomb till after the Glaive Beam. Yeah, Glaive Beam tip into weapons. I think that's correct. Okay, I need to... We're really slow on that. Okay, I like that. All right, let's try to move our power this time, like uh, talking about. Okay, nice. I want to see what that did first. Okay, nice. Don't even have to use a missile now. Wow, we even hit his O2 there with that uh, placement. I don't know if I've ever seen him hit two rooms after getting through his ultimate shield before. I mean, I'm so good. <laughs> I'm so good at aiming my beams. Okay, I forgot to do this. I am accidentally cloaking at the right time and accidentally doing the best swipes of my life. Um, do I get power? Or is it back to saving up for hacking? I think we don't spend scrap on power right now. That's a hacking. Okay. Okay. Okay, that's a good hack for us. Although if I'm doing the whole venting trick, do I even do I even do this anymore? Because we have level three cloaking. I wonder if I should do this so I don't have to vent my own guy to get our power back. Maybe I can change where I vent. You can also start the beam to remove Zoltan shields, shoot laser shields to remove shields, and the beam enters room to deal more damage than otherwise. That's hard on no pause though, yeah. That's enough, I think, to be at below 50. Well, when our O2 turns off, it is. What was at this store? Mm, nothing we care about, I don't think. Okay. Okay, there's the timing there. It looks like we... Even with level 3 cloaking, can still do fire the eye on. Uh, I think I don't need that, actually. I'm agreed. Not use a bomb. Cool. Well, I will say... We got down to one health and we're still alive. We might still die, but hey. Down to one health and not dead on this ship is, you know, better than other attempts I've had on this ship. I will say. Probably tempting fate by saying anything, but there we go. 51 scrap. One, two, three, four, five. I can get five if I go through two nebulas. If there are two empty jumps, is it worth it? Uh, I mean, let's just see what's over here. I'm trying to decide if maybe I should be doing like a door upgrade since we're in Zoltan Sector. Zoltan Border Police probably end our run too, depending on where they board. Well, we never get Zoltan Border Police in Nebula. Nebula. Can't afford the doors? Yeah. Empty. M2. 
50. Damn. I mean, because now we just need shields, right? We just need shields. Okay. They're in my O2. Okay. Okay, at least there's no nothing firing at us here. Oh, God. Free human borders, man. Alright, no damage. It's fine. Did we get anything out of that? No, we didn't gain anything at all. Just stupid, worthless, annoying humans. Get off my ship, humanitis. Five, I think it was only four. I think it was only four. Four or five is four or five too many. It was five? Okay. You like five guys as a restaurant better? Me too. <laughs> I agree. Hey, you guys didn't even give me a cheeseburger. Worst five guys I've ever been to. Worst five guys ever. Do I hit four rooms here? Yes, which should be a one shot, right? Two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, yeah. It's got boarding. I'm hitting this. Well, I'm not sure if I'm hitting that. Let's go and use the ion bomb then. Okay. Ugh. I don't know if I got that swipe right. If I'm not hitting weapons, I think I better take the surrender. Can hit five if I start in clone bay. Oh, that would have been better, yeah. So used to hitting shields first, you're right. If he hits my weapons, I'm screwed, so I think I take the deal. Okay, he didn't hit my weapons, but still. If he hit my weapons, actually, this guy just died. Yeah, I should I should have taken the five swipe, that's my bad. But I was I was boarded and uh, I kind of I messed up my micro there. They also only had two weapon power, so I could start in weapons for safety. Yeah, yeah, there were a couple different ways I could have done that. I thought I could get the I thought I could get the four swipe through shields. Clay beam just sucks. It's just sucks. I can't do that. I need shields. Okay. Okay. Abandoned three is actually good for us, right? It's definitely better than the Zoltan. I know that. We can't get uh, Lenya's bombers. Asteroid field would be a bad idea. Lenius don't have drones, that is really nice. They will have two shields. Uh, okay, he's got hacking, a missile, and a mini beam. That's really bad. Mini beam. Oh, I forgot to vent. <sighs> I think I'm dead. This guy's about to die too. Because I don't have enough power. 
two hacks on weapons. I I don't. What was the counterplay to that? Have more dodge and have not, not use my cloaking. I don't even know. I don't know if there was a counterplay at all to that. Have more hole, yeah. Hey, remember what I said? One and out. Look at that. One and out. An amazing one streak. Yeah, the only the only outplay to that is get luckier and not be so dead. Oh man, ship sucks. It's one of my better attempts on stealth B. Got to sector three. You've been tempted to not upgrade for the ion bomb straight away and take more repairs at that store. If I didn't take ion bomb, you are you are playing store Russian roulette that you're gonna find some way to get through two shields before Sector 3. Uh, I watch FTL. I th I think Britnoth is right that getting the Ion Bomb was good. I think there was also merit to taking the flak and swapping off of the Glaive Beam. Um, if I had sold the Glaive Beam and got flak one chain laser, we don't one-shot people, but we get two volleys off in the time we'd get a single volley off in Glade Beam. And we could have afforded repairs there too. You mean don't buy, you don't upgrade weapons? Oh, buy the bomb and not upgrade the weapons. Oh, okay. Well, oh well, lots of, lots of choices we could have made. I made the choices I thought were the best at the time. It didn't work out. All right, well, let's start another streak. One and done, man. One and done, I swear. Friggin' FTL just does not want me to get any better at these Harbaugh no pause streaks, I swear. All right, let's see what we got. Three, two, one, random. That's the wrong button. Random. All right, Lanius B. Arguably the strongest ship in the game. Maybe we can have some better luck. Who knows? Hindsight 2020. <laughs> see, I don't even know if I'd say hindsight... 2020 is it like even was that even better would i have done better i don't know i could have died at the same exact jump could have died earlier i don't know another on you thought i got salty i got pretty salty but not rage quit salty i'm trying to improve my mental to not just you know well, I will say, at the beginning of streaks, if I lose, it's not as rough when I'm at, like, seven in a row, and then I die, you know? Oh, you're a, you're a beam master. Okay. Then let's go for engines, so that you can't run away, hopefully. And it's also, that's the worst ship in the game for Harbaugh no pausing. Arguably the worst ship in the game, so if I don't get a win on the stealth B, I'm not gonna beat myself up and rage quit forever. Uh in terms of weapon changes or the upgrade choices, just the whole thing. Because a loss always great, so yeah. It's always it's always sucks to lose. I'm trying to starve the saltest crew. Sure. A map, okay, that's nice. Map at the beginning of the sector, good. Map at the end of the sector, troll. The stealth beat die? Yeah, big, big, big surprise. All right, so we got a store there. One, two, three, four, store. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. What's the best way to do this? I would like to get all my jumps. 11, 10, 9, 8. Nope, I can't go up that way. It's a dead end. 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2. I cannot see a way to get the store efficiently and get all 11 jumps. Alright, I do see a way. It would be 
One, two, three, four. I guess we do that. Uh, you want to be one Lanius? Okay, sure. Vega. And Shaka Lisa Top. Shaka Lisa Top. There you go. Don't get too comfy, because usually when I play this ship, I fail somehow and get wrecked like I'm playing freaking Stealth B. But... Okay. We do have a boarding mind control, so we board shields, mind control if we need to. I think he's got three crew, yeah. Fourth freaking spam call of the day. Get the F out of my life, you spam callers. Get the F out. Okay, there's a fire in here. I can equally say that 50 scrap into weapons avoids you taking damage back to 10 hull if a beam drone swipes you there. What's up, GRVL? What are we talking about? We're still talking about last run? <laughs> Yeah, I mean, if I had changed out my weapons, the Lanius, or the uh, the ship that killed me, I would have gotten at least one shot off. And maybe I could have taken the hacking down. I don't know. A lot of ways that could have played out. We have emergency respirators to sell. Fifty scrap and weapons versus repairing back to green. Ah, okay. Okay, um, so we always sell these. I guess we get an Ion Blast? It's not my favorite. And do I do anything at this store? Stealth Beast suffer so badly from catastrophic failure, 10 hull or 20 often makes a little difference, yeah. I mean, it snowballs so fast. You don't one-shot, you're pretty much dead on any fight that you don't one-shot. No, I don't think we want Reloader. Um, chain Laser, I have a little below Burst Laser. I think it's like A or B tier. It's decent, but... Ion Blast is the try-hard safe move. Can't get it online. But I think I just do like Ion Blast early. It's a value point for flak, if nothing else, once we get it online. Hacking. Um, let's just take the free stuff. Because that is enough to get our value point there. Next, I probably want to get one engine power than shields. Firebomb to reset our crew. Interesting. That's actually... Yeah, that's, that's an interesting idea. I don't hate it, honestly. Don't hate it. I think he's only got two crew here, but... No, that's three crew. If I can, I do want to reset my crew here. Which means... Let me make sure it doesn't hit my clone bay. Okay. I'm gonna actually shoot at my own guys here. Purposely reset our guys when he's got no weapons. I should. I feel like I need to do this more often when I play. Reset my own crew when I have the chance by shooting them. Good. Uh, use flak for shields and ion weapons with a shot that can't whiff on one by two rooms, which isn't a problem 99% of the time because you have mind control. Uh, what? Oh, you're talking the Vegas thing. I mean, Lanius B has a problem not being able to reset your Lanius safely. Uh, safely, yeah. If I mean, if you if you like take their weapons offline and then shoot your own crew, like I just did, that's a it's a thing you can do. I just need to get better at it. How many jumps do we have? Six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah. It just depends on the ship you're fighting, I think. So when I do have a safe option or safe. Uh, Safe way to do it. Definitely worth.
And Britain, now you're saying do something like this. Advance, <laughs> use Ion Blast like it's actually a basic laser or something. I could refresh my dudes, but I don't really need to. This will never kill him. Board shields, mind control shields, run to med bay, clone bay, and break it. Shoot weapons for taste. Okay. Mmm, God. Do we actually take damage now? Surely, surely we won't. Okay, good. You try to avoid face tanking with Lanius, board shields, mind control, let them fight. Run to O2, break it, then just run around the ship. Okay. I see. So you like to, um... Board with them, pulls them into a room, mind control one guy, and then go kill other things. Other things being heal bays if they have them, O2 if they don't, for O2 crew kills and that kind of thing. Nice. That's almost shield. I'm going to do this first. I'm going to get one power. That'll let us get the second shield once we have enough for it. Done well. You don't even have to clone the Lanius. Okay. Give that a try here. No heal base, so we'll try. We'll we'll try the board shields, mind control, run to O2 thing. Uh, it's only a two person. Uh, I think that still works, right? Doesn't work if I don't move my crew in the teleporter. God damn it! Uh, did I time that right? Okay, yeah. Oh, crap. I didn't even hear the damn fire in there. Just too focused on the boarding, Micro Man. Uh... To be honest, this would be a decent ship without the clone bay. Uh, you mean having a heal bay to repair your ship? Yeah. Fun fact, Lanius are slightly slower than most crew. On two tile shields, you need to move one guy out so the mind control crew stays. Okay. Thankfully, that didn't wreck us there, but yeah, it makes sense. Let's get the shield value. Oh, you're saying having neither would still be a good ship. Well... Not everybody as good as you at uh, Hard Mode No Pause uh, Micro, so. <laughs> know about this. That's nice. Uh, let's move you to uh, uh, Engine so you'll be able to move around there. Empty jump is empty. St would still be better than Slug B. I mean, Slugby has Heal Bomb. I agree. This still seems risky. Okay, Beam Drone, don't have to do anything. Just auto fire. Doop, doop, doop. Like back when this game came out, or when the Advanced Edition came out. If they had a ship with boarding, no heal bay, no clone bay, no... That had teleporter and no heal bay, clone bay, or uh, heal bomb. That feels like a busted ship, I don't know. Like seriously, no, no even passive healing? I don't know about that. I don't know that that would be better than Slug B. I mean... Zero way to heal or reset your crew. Just seems a troll. Now there's a choice. Two best sector choices for sector two, probably. You would have to hack enemy med bay to heal or something. <laughs> now that would be interesting. Uh, I probably abandoned, right? Is abandoned better than civilian? This is more likely to get a store, but 
I think we get more scrap from Abandoned, especially with Lanius. Although Lanius blue options often avoid fights. I guess I'll take Abandoned. I don't know that I'd want to buy more Lanius, honestly. All those Sector 6 and 7 reds. Hmm, yay. Okay, are you another beam? You have another beam. Wow, the number of uh, beam masters this run. Sir, I'm glad I didn't fight all these beam masters last run. Although maybe I should have been happier, it would have been over quicker. Free Dr. Jones, Lanius. Yes, yeah, I guess there are those events that are free, uh, free random crew, which can be randomly Lanius in this sector. Slavers. Are there slavers in Abandoned that can offer you up free crew? I'm not sure. Can't remember. Alright, we can get our second shield. Just not the power. Okay. Can't damage us if he doesn't hack shields. Okay, well, never mind. Just had to open my big fat mouth. Okay, we don't need to kill that. And if they don't offer crew, you kill their crew. Get our fighting training from this. Okay, that never kills them. Bring them back. You go. Yes. Get training. Do, 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 do. Maximum chance of Alanius. You could damage them until they surrender. If they don't offer crew, then you kill their crew for a chance at crew. Gotcha. Quick man, tell them they can't damage you if they give you $10 million as a supermodel wife. <laughs> oh, wow, that actually almost did damage there. I mean, would you really want a supermodel for a wife? Everybody's always looking at your wife all the time. Like, everybody's always leering. They're like, you're not good enough for her. I don't know, sounds like a lot of pressure. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2... One. I mean, with 34 scrap, do I even want to go to this store? Could get long range scanners, I guess. Supermodel wife sounds like an incredibly expensive upkeep on hair, nails. Well, hopefully she could pay for that. <laughs> She's a supermodel, you know? Uh, do I sound really cheap by saying my supermodel wife should pay for her own hair, nails, and makeup? <laughs> All right, can't do damage to me. He's got clone bay. All right, let's try this. This thing here. This here. This there. Then go there. And he can't do damage, so we'll just shoot at his O2, I guess. Okay. Nice. Are they fully trained? Uh, no, both level one. Okay. She retires to be a stay-at-home wife to her successful streamer husband. <laughs> so, yeah, yeah. My my ghetto house that I a ghetto apartment I live in shows how successful I am. I swear I hear freaking gunshots almost every day. <laughs> We're coming from somewhere out there. Uh, yeah. Yeah, even with the lane itself, we can't do that. Um, six, five, four, three, two. That's the only real way we have to go, unless we go one, two, three, four, five, six. That is two guaranteed ship fights. 
I don't know what's up there. Could be another store. I don't really want another store. Let's go ahead and just get go kind of this little roundabout way here. I did order the UPS, actually. It is in a box over there uh, on the other side of my table. I just haven't set it up yet. So I'm saying I have ambiance. You know it. You know it. If you like to live dangerously, then come live in Northeast Dallas. Okay, this guy can't do damage, so let's just get weapon training. And maybe some doge training. What do you mean this isn't Beverly Hills? Aren't all Texans shooting in the air all the time? Uh, I mean, if it's 4th of July, maybe. But February 22nd, 2022? I don't think there's any excuse to be shooting guns in the air all the time. With my millions, I could buy a massive ranch in Frisco. Or, uh... You know, where my church job is, just buy one of those mansions. There are there are some crazy, crazy mansions in Dallas. I swear, if you drive around where I where I sing for my church. How the hell does that how am I how am I so dumb that I didn't see that didn't connect? Ugh. Um there are some houses that look like castles in the places in Texas anyway. Um, I guess I'll board shields my control. And shoot weapons. Ouch. Okay, I thought that guy maybe would move to fight that one guy. No, he's apparently just gonna shoot this guy over and over. Ah, oh, damn it. I would hope I'd kill my crew. I shouldn't have done that. Oh, I thought it would do more damage to my crew. Oh, uh, did I read the old meme? One guy posts, if you see joggers, house prices are going up. And then another says, one day after I moved in, I heard gunshots and went to check. The neighbor said he just randomly fires gun guns to keep house prices realistic. I have not heard that meme, no. Maybe a companion queue behind is considered a portal sin. Wow, okay. Random puns, all right. Damn, I just shot my own guy, and that's just bad. Man, how did I, how the hell did I miss judge that? Just wasted two jumps, I think. Houston, you don't like the armpit of America? Have you ever been to Mississippi? Because I have. And, uh, the roads there will change your definition of armpit of America. Got a flat tire in frickin' Mississippi, and it was, it was a bad time. Or was it Missouri? I don't know. I think I drove through both. <laughs> they were both kind of like, oh my gosh. Can't even drive here without... Friggin... Having to do repairs to my car. Uh, 58 scrap. Sorry for anybody who lives there. I'm sure it's lovely in certain areas. Rand staring at FTL looks like a lost soul. Yes, I feel like a lost soul. I have a free NG? No. Okay. Well, that was a pretty crappy uh, abandoned. I want to abandon. All I got is this T-shirt. I mean, these long-range scanners. Oh uh, man, you know what? Pirate's probably better than NG here, right? I can board and pirate. Maybe get some free crew. You lived in Kentucky for five years. Every stereotype is true. <laughs> Uh, I do have NG for blue options, though. What do you all think? Pirate or NG? Pirate or NG? We have NG for blue options. Be more stores. 
Why did the chicken cross the road to get out of Kentucky? Nice. <laughs> Hmm. Yeah, that is a bunch of red sectors over here. I'm just gonna go NG. I just I like NG sectors. Oh my god, that's a big giant missile heel bay. Okay, so. Okay, so I think I'm going to board shields. Move one guy out, mind control another guy, and then move the other guy out, I think is what we need to do. Oh, he still boarded us, damn it. Oh, it's a bunch of NGs on this Mantis ship. Okay. I'm way too late on this. Okay, well, the heel bay is borked. Uh, really, all right. Oh my god, can we not take another missile, please? Okay, good. All right, it's a good strategy, I like it. Board shields. Mind control, then run to kill the, the system you need to. Nice red mouth. Angies are soft and squishy. Thought they were made of metal. Like nano nanobots or something. Maybe they're very soft and squishy metal nanobots. <clears throat> did you just Did you just clip me saying I am not dead inside? <laughs> oh there's my stores. What am I looking for? I'm looking for a weapon that's not an ion blast to go with my advanced flak, so one ship fight, then one store, maybe two stores. We'll see. Okay. This guy is freaking strong, man. Nice missile offline, perfect. I should pull the pilot. Good. Okay. My lanius are really low and I can't really heal them. Maybe I need to upgrade clone bay. I guess there's a chance at reconstructive, but Britnoth always says that's a trap. I don't know. Do you still think it's a trap on this ship, Britnoth, when you have no way to reset your crew? There's hacking. Your only system hacking is really good. Stopping them from moving in and out of systems. So maybe hacking power and I don't know. You clipped me staring, lost and traumatized before mentioning something about Missouri. Okay. <laughs> it's just expensive for not doing much, but it does something on this ship. Like, there's literally no way to heal your crew except upgrading clone bay. I mean, it's not really an option here, so anyway. The thing about taking hacking is you don't have missile defense if you take hacking, unless you count hacking as your missile defense, which I guess you can can do. Um, do you get hacking or cloaking on this ship? Actually, I actually have just enough to got, get hacking and upgrade my clone bay if I want to. Hacking is safe, you think? I'm gonna get one power first. And oh gosh, I don't have an efficient route that doesn't entail or doesn't require me to go through the store. This is a terrible sector layout. What is this? I could have nine, except I only get seven because of this jump. Uh, I guess it's six, seven, eight, nine. Oh, what a sh shabby sector. God, this is a terrible layout, man. I'm actually gonna 
buy a couple fuel here. I have long range scanners, right? I do, I just have all the empty jumps in NG Sector, I guess. Hacking more useful for crew kills late game with door locking and auction sucking. Yeah, makes sense. No, well, that's that's nice at least. All right, I want to get um, the clone bay up next. Wow, that weapon system though. Okay. I'm gonna masala maneuver this and then um, and then board. Wow, they still got both missiles off uh, fired. late there. Goddamn double missile ships, man. Oh, there's one dodge at least. What level O2 is this? In their ship or my ship? I don't I don't I don't know what you're asking. Hacking just too OP. Hacking is really OP. Why is why is why is there no O2 in this room? The hell? Oh, you're saying because Arlanias took forever to vent their ship. You're asking what level it was. Gotcha. All right, clone bay value and power. All right, man, my weapons are not very good. Man, I used hacking, mind control, and teleporter all on their weapons room, and I still took like seven frickin' missiles or something. Oh my god, it's another store when I have no scrap. Oh my god. Oh, these are such horrible store locations. God, this is an effing bullshit sector layout. I'm not even going to the store. I'm saving my fuel by not going to the store with two scrap. Oh, this is terrible. I see... This is a sector that's showing why... Britnoth could be justified in saying how crappy Zoltan, uh, NG sectors are. Usually they're not this stupidly bad, though. It's very rare, in my opinion, that they get this horribly, horribly bad. Well, that's four crew on their ship. <laughs> uh, it is fun watching them walk around and be like, oh, I don't want to be vented and then dying. Oh, it's the store with a burst laser. Hmm. Hey, what's up, Sirloin of Beef? Oh, man. 80 scrap. Any way I can get that? 30, 50... 80. If I sold everything, I could trade out my advanced flak for a burst laser, too. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't think that's the right choice. I want it all. No, I only want one thing. Just this. Just that. But I can't get anything, because we're behind. Buy more 
fuel, I guess. God, we're so far behind, man. Oh, geez. Zoltan or Rock, those are my choices. If I don't have Zoltan Shield Bypass... Ugh. Oh, man. You gotta go ahead, earn a bedtime, alright, have a good night, Wham Bam Bolo. Dragon Crew through o list rooms is a good strat to avoid face tanking damage with Lanius, yeah. <sighs> I'd probably die by doing this, but... Things are looking grim, yeah. We got one decent win today, and then everything else has been just kind of crap all day. Half power... Well, we do have Clone Bay for manually search. It's not manually search. Okay. A pirate hacker in a nebula. Of course it is. Oh my god. Who actually shoot his missile down? Oh, that's on fire. Oh, God. Single missile. I now have no shields. <sighs> we're just, we're just dead, man. We're just dead. Oh, <laughs> he hacks my mind control right as I try to have mind control him. down there. His crew isn't even all dead yet. Okay, can we at least get his weapons offline, please? Love of God, how many fucking value points do you have? They hacked again. Yeah, this is over. Jesus. <laughs> oh, man. I'm so done with hard but no pause. I can't make any progress, man. I go from the worst ship in the game to arguably the best ship in the game and still can't win. I just, I can't, I, I can't get any better. I, I can't seem to improve. Don't know. I don't know how to get better at this game, man. I swear. Yeah, we lose all the crew anyway. Oh, he's dead. Okay. Bad luck. Yeah, I guess so. But if you, if, but every time you play, it's bad luck. Is it bad luck anymore? Is it really bad luck if it happens every time you play, or are you just bad at the game? Because that's what it feels like. It just feels like I'm bad at the game. Three health, one crew. I don't know, man. I, I probably could have hacked earlier. I was dealing with freaking mind control. I don't even know, man. This is just This is just me getting fed up and frustrated with FTL. I just, I can't. I can't seem to make any plays, man. Do I even care about repairing this and restarting this? With a single ion blast and advanced flak. Ugh. To be fair, Slane's B we're talking about. It's incredibly difficult to lose unless you're absurdly unlucky. I don't know, man. Really? Really? Every time I play this ship, I feel like I just... I can't... I can't get anywhere. I can't find weapons. I 
I'm gonna let you all watch me die while I go take a break while I decide if I want to suffer through FTL's BS anymore. So, real quickly, stand up, stretch. Thanks for hanging out. Y'all rock. Enjoy my death. I'll be back in a bit, my friends.